to I Team 8 now. Distracted driving increasing despite the 2020 Indiana hands free law. I Team 8's Jasmine Miner digs into what experts say needs to change. Law enforcement is doing their part. They've issued thousands of citations throughout the state to distracted drivers on their phone. But while troopers and police do what they can, I'm told the ultimate impact will come with a culture change. I have a friend who, when he starts his car, he throws his cell phone on the floorboard of the passenger uh, compartment just so he can't reach it because he said it's just too tempting for me. Whatever it takes to stay safe. I can really think of no phone call that's worth taking a chance with your life or the life of somebody else. Indiana Senator Michael Kreider was the first sponsor of the hands-free law in 2020. I team mate wanted to know how many tickets have actually been issued since then. The Indiana Criminal Justice Institute tells me the number is more than 14,000. It's slightly decreased post-pandemic from 2021 to 2022. The numbers of uh, tickets, for instance, go down doesn't necessarily mean that there's less distracted driving. And he's right. People still drive around watching, you know, Netflix videos while they're driving. Data also shows the number of crashes, fatalities, and distracted driving increased in the same time period. The big reasons why crashes occur, generally speaking, are speeding. Uh, distracted driving is definitely a, a, a high high incident rate with with crashes. Devin McDonald is the executive director of the Criminal Justice Institute. He says those numbers are concerning, which is why they are working to educate more people on the dangers of distracted driving. The big thing is going to be a culture shift in society, just like, you know, it used to be OK to drink and drive. It used to be OK to not wear your seatbelt. Um, it took years and years and years, decades even to kind of shift that mindset for the general public. We're very much there with with cell phone usage. Senator Kreider tells me he is in active discussions on how to use future technology to lower the temptation for drivers to pick up their phones. Technology like automatically disabling texts and calls when you get in a car. I'm Jasmine Miner for Wish TV, I to